has a fun tune called Indian Corn. If you enjoy this video and you'd like to see more, please consider joining my fiddle club on Patreon, where members get a weekly fiddle tune video like this, and the sheet music, and other fun stuff. This is an old time tune, which means that the emphasis is on keeping people dancing rather than uh, like in bluegrass music where you take breaks and try to be really inventive with your solos. But that doesn't mean that there isn't some room with this one. The, one of the things I like to do with fiddle tunes is break them down to their bare bones. So with this tune, you pretty much have G and B, G and C, G and B, and then kind of your bones of it. And then you can kind of add things on as you get more comfortable with the tune. The B section, if I were going to kind of break it down like I was saying, I go... some different choices in there but essentially what I just did was played the first the second and the third beat and I left all that other stuff out of there so that would actually work kind of nicely for a variation the double stops that you can use in this tune are pretty straightforward the I'm just keeping my third finger down the G and playing <laughs> while I go up to the B. Right before the first and second ending, I can just use an open D. Open G. Open G again. And then for the B section, I can keep an open D and then an open G. I'm just keeping my bow on both the G string and the D string and let my fingers, the melody line, cross from the D string to the G string. So now the harmony is on top instead of on the bottom. An open D here in anticipation of the D chord. The open D, G, so it's basically the same during the second half of that phrase. I kept my bow on the G string and the D string and let the melody line cross from being above to being below. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.